Hey guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the stick man animation. So first of all, let me introduce you for the stick man animation. Stick man, stick man animation is like for starters for animating. That's what I used when I just started animation. So it's really cool though. You can do a lot of stuff with it. So double click on that and I'll show this part later. I'll first show you this part and this part. These two parts. So first let's start with file. There's gonna be a lot of it. New, open animation, save animation, low background, low figure, create a figure. You, first of all, let's see load figure type. You're gonna, you're, it's gonna pop out a thing that says realistic man, man, something, something, something like that. So you can add whatever you want. Like if you wanna add a horse, click on it. And there you got a horse. But what if you wanna delete it? You just put delete. <laughs> so that's pretty easy. And options, you can change the animation person's you know height and stuff it's gonna turn like this and next you can if you choose like if you want to add a figure you just press on this as many as you want add a figure as if add a figure add a figure add a figure so he got a double twin he got a triple twin oh that's a lot of twins so yeah that's gonna be a lot of people just made me think of a new animation so that's i think that's it that's all his twin brothers so next you can delete it delete 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 there's only one more so you can edit you can add a you can do this to him. You can add a pants for him. You can do whatever. Then you can do the center. The center will be... You're going to add another one. Another one. So, yeah. It's pretty cool. So, next you're going to flip. It doesn't do anything to the human, the stick man. But if you add a horse, add a figure... So let this man get out of here. If you had a horse, you flip it, then the horse head is gonna flip over and flip over and flip over. So that's pretty cool. And the next thing is colors. It's gonna pop out a lot of colors. If you like pink, which I don't really like, you can click on pink. I like yellow, so I'm gonna click on yellow. I'm gonna turn my sick man to a yellow sick man. You can make as big as you want for the stick man. You can make a papa stick man, a mama stick man, and a baby stick man. But I just like to leave it into 100. You can also do it like that, like 1 or 10 or 11 or huge or just a big pine of yellow. So I'm just turning it back to 100. You can do front and back. You can do front and back. It doesn't work for that, but it works for horses. So let's see. Add a figure. I don't enjoy this black horse. I'm going to delete this man. And I'm going to change the color into a orange horse. Okay, orange. I can't see the center. So I'm just going to change it black into back to in red. A red one. Yay. So pretty. But I still can't see the dots, which makes me frustrated. But I'm just going to turn it back into ice blue. Wow, pretty, eh? So front and back. can do this. can do this and this and kick it and yeah, let's do this. And you can add next frame. So what is next frame for? Next frame. Okay, I'm going to change this really quick. Next frame is for this like this is a person and I'm gonna put this right here at a next frame and I'm gonna put his 
arm like this. The good part about this is that it has an onion skin. What does onion skin mean? It's like pencil. It's like the software pencil where you draw it and then it stays right there. So yeah. Next frame, and then you're gonna put like da 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 or maybe not. So I'm gonna change it back. I'm just gonna make it do a flip. So I'm gonna turn it a little, add a frame, turn it a little, add a frame. Turn it a little, add a frame, and do it again and again and again. I think that's what all animations do. They just do the same thing, almost the same, okay? Almost the same thing again and again to make it, like, walk and stuff and, you know, sit, you know, stuff. So I'm almost done with my new stuff. After this, I can show you my one minute or something like that animation. So, there you got it. You got yourself a thing. So, this is the speed limit thing. So, if you wanted to go it really slow, it will go really slow. If you got, wanted to go really fast, it looks weird. But I like to go at like minimum, you know, like that. Okay. So now I'm going to open an animation. You can do a horse revenge. Would you like to create an animation? Yes. No. So you can do, you can see this. It's pretty cool, but it, I didn't make this. You can see it by using load background. Wait, load background? Okay, not load background, I'm sorry. You can do it as open animation yeah and then you just play it and it'll look like this ah, bing, bang. Ah, boom. Ah. and there's another one open animation you can do tower fall this one is a pretty long one so I'm gonna click play it there's a elephant There's the man. And then the elephant was gone. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. So that's it. Now I'm going to show you my animation. So sick man things. Family horse. Enjoy this amazing thing. It's pretty long, see? The little thing is like that long. So watch it as you go. I'm gonna stop, play again. Go really slow. Hey baby, what's up? Oh, that's my horse. No, don't go, humans. I need you. Oh, hi there. You're so pretty. Donkey hey, dong. Wow, we fell in love. And then she had a baby. Watch this. This one's really funny. So. <laughs> So yeah, it's pretty cool. And then the little horse grew bigger and bigger. Boosh. I grew bigger and bigger. And the last part is pretty funny too. The yellow sick man got kicked in the face. Boosh. Yeah. Up there. Pretty cool, eh? Yeah, that's it. And there's a second one. This one isn't as long as it was like last time, but it's pretty good too. Two horse met it and they had children, I think. No, it didn't have children. Oh, it got carried away. All right. So, yeah, that's it for today's tutorial. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Have a nice day and jump off a cliff.